Sorry, y'all. I have to make sure we do <laughs> Right. <laughs> Um, I have to make sure that we held space for all of our love. So this one is number 16. And it goes, it'll go, cops and borders, we don't need them. What we need is total freedom. Cops and borders, we don't need them. What we need is total freedom. Okay, cops and borders, we don't need them. What we need is total freedom. All right, that was perfect. And then one more, just because yesterday, or Friday, I got to hang out with the Congress of the Congress of Day Labor, who are an amazing organization. My babies, I love them. And so, um, I really, I don't know if this is not my place, but I definitely want to do the no papers, no care. You want to do that? You sure? Okay. Yeah, I heard the conference. Okay. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Okay. Ready? Ready? Four by four. Okay. <laughs> We are stepping up. We are coming up. We just have to share with each other. Sin papeles. Sin papeles. Sin papeles. Sin papeles. Sin papeles. No papers. No fear. No papers. No fear. No papers. No fear. Alright. Thank y'all so much for letting me teach y'all some of our chants. I love so y'all love y'all so much. I get so excited to give me some. Thank y'all. Doing this on Facebook Live. Oh, okay. Pop cool. Smart Nola, which is a website that I have. What is it? Uh, Pop Smart Nola. It's a culture website about New Orleans. Okay. And do you mind if I interview you guys while we're here? I mean, you're doing it already. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, what brought you down here today? Oh, wait, wait, wait. wait. Give them one mic. Oh. Come up some more. Technical difficulties while they get ready to do another event. Yeah. Wait, can y'all help? Yeah. Hey, in the back. Can people in the back here. 
Keisha, hope y'all are enjoying yourself so far. Before we get started, a little more. Um, me and Mia are going to demonstrate a self reiki practice called Kinyoku, which is basically a dry bath, and you can use it to get rid of negative energy, the residue of the day, or when you're not really feeling yourself in the middle of the day. Cool. So we'll demonstrate it. We'll demonstrate it once. Can you tell these beautiful people who you are and what you do? Oh, I'm sorry. I thought I got an introduction. I thought I, I got that all that already. My bad. <laughs> I'm Malay. Um, I use the pronoun Shay Shim or they, them. And I'm from New Orleans. Work here at Breakout. Yes. <laughs> um, me and Mia, uh, show y'all once and then we'll do it twice together. Alright, let's try it one time. Okay, let's try it together, y'all. Alright, ready? If you feel comfortable, off. Alright. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two. Shake it out. Alright, y'all. One more time, one more time. Let go of that energy, let go of what does not serve you. My name is Jay. I use the pronouns they, them, and theirs, and I'm the lead organizer over at Breakout. Um, so I'm here to introduce to you one of our beautiful members, um, Miss Arelli Wesley. Um, Arelli, <laughs> yes, um, so Arelli is going to share a couple words with us around collective liberation and collaboration and how important that is for our movements and why that is important for our movements. Arelli? Thank you. Okay. Like Jay said, my name. My name is Arely Wesley, and I'm very happy to be here with y'all today and share some moments with you. Today, um, I'm going to talk to you about a little collaboration in between communities and how it's important for us to come together with another group of another community. I know that, that for us, it's, it's a community. It's really no easy fight for our rights and all the things that we have to face. And have and have to go through on our daily on our daily days. We face every day a strong level of discrimination and discrimination for our color skin or sexual orientation or gen gender identity. And just because for the way to look different and be different. That's why it's really important for all communities to stay in up and get together. It's on one community. It's the one community that support each other and fight each other. It's strong and fight with all that things that are against us every day. It's very important to be together and stay strong. It's a community because moving is one group or community. We don't go to move forward. We need to get together and get strong every day. Wake up and say we need to get together with someone else so we can fight against with all the discrimination. And the humanitation that we face every day. Every day, all trans Latino women, all trans black women, every single day we have to face discrimination. We have to be dealing with uh, criminalization. Sometimes for all Latinx communities, it's hard too because we have to face, like, move every day with. Uh, criminalization, where they ask you for one ID or they ask you for uh, your color of skin. So it's time to be together and stand up and say it's time to fight, but it's time to fight together. Show love one another, support one another, get involved with others. Even we don't speak 
the language, try to communicate each other. That way we're going to be strong. Because staying down is one group, we don't go moving. We've been having years and years all our energies on this fight. But this is time to start getting get more strong. Because what we have to go through is a lot. So we need to stay together. Let's go, sister.